Item ID AEP050. Enclosure designation. Oriens. Threat classification. Anom 00. Adaptive enclosure protocols. AEP050 is to be enclosed in a 5 cm by 5 cm by 5 cm thick steel box at site 515. This box is to be equipped with two keycard readers that require two Division 4 Plus keycards to open. Any testing or usage of AEP050 is to be supervised by two Division 4 personnel and at least five members of the ADF. AEP050's enclosure cell is to be kept under active surveillance at all times by ADF stationed nearby. Unauthorized personnel found in AEP050's enclosure cell are to be detained using all necessary ports terminated. Under no circumstances should any Class O personnel be permitted into AEP050's containment cell unless accompanied by personnel with Division 4 plus security clearance. After Incident 050-1, no members of Class O personnel are to enter AEP050's containment at any time. Any experiments requiring the use of Class O or lower personnel are to be performed at least 10 meters away from them, without their knowledge. AEP050 is to be used by two members of Class B or higher personnel. AEP050 usage must be documented after each use. AEP050 is to immediately be placed back into its enclosure after authorized usage. Description AEP050 is a small, dull silver coin measuring 24.6 mm by 1.75 mm. AEP050's features are worn, though the coin itself displays no noteworthy scratches or dents. It features two sides that can be easily defined as heads or tails, similar to many known currencies. Features of each side are clearly visible, yet worn. The top side heads of the coin features a worn outline of an unknown figure, suspected to be a man of unknown identity. The tails side of AEP050 bears a label in its center, surrounded in vines that are commonly found on United States minted coins. The label reads, One cent, and is written in Times New Roman font. Just below the label, a bell, labeled with the number one, is distinguishable. AEP050 has marking consistent with 18th century coinage from the American colonies. Though the true manufacturing date of AEP050 is unknown to the association, the outer three millimeters of metal around the edges is featureless and worn, yet the edges are pristine and ridged despite the condition of AEP050's other features. AEP-050 shows its anomalous properties when two sapient individuals participate in a coin flip. Each participant has to state what they wish to happen before flipping the coin, or AEP-050 will show no anomalous properties. AEP-050 will, through unknown means, grant the wish of the winner of the coin flip. Association testing has revealed that the wish-granting properties have concrete limits. See test log for tests regarding this limit. Currently, the largest known use of AEP-050's anomalous effects is the destruction of Iowa. It is also recorded that there is a low chance that the winner's wish will be reversed and the opposite will occur. It has been shown that any individual included in the coin flip is incapable of using AEP-050 again. It is notable that if an individual attempts a coin flip with an individual who has not yet attempted to use AEP-050. The individual who has not yet used AEP-050 will lose the ability to use it and will not receive a wish, even if they win. There are no physical or cognitive barriers to stop anyone from attempting to use AEP-050 again, and will instead act as a normal coin. AEP-050 will always land on the side that it landed on in a previous encounter, when flipped by someone who has previously used it. Access experiment 050-01. Participant 1. 05714. Participant 2. 07821. Forward. 05714 was instructed to wish for better food, and 07821 was instructed to wish for the destruction of AEP. Wishes. 05714 was recorded to say, I wish for some good fucking food for once and predicted heads. 07821 was recorded to say, I wish he would just shut the hell up. 
and predicted tails. Result tails. O5714 immediately lost all abilities to perform speech. Association testing has proven that O5714 has lost all usage of his vocal cords and has incurable muteness. O5714 was taken and studied for days before being terminated. O7821 was taken back to their cell. Texas Experiment 050-02 Participant 1 O0812 Participant 2 O7821 Forward O0812 was instructed to wish for a Redo on life to test the capabilities of temporal changes and O7821 was again instructed to wish for the destruction of AEP with threat of termination Wishes O0812 was recorded to say, I wish I could take it all back and have my wife back. And predicted tales. O7821 was recorded to say, I wish that AEP would be destroyed. And predicted heads. Result tales. Despite O0812 winning the coin flip, his wish was not granted by AEP050. Further testing revealed that a previous participant in AEP050 will result in neither participant gaining a wish, as well as ruining the other one's ability to use AEP-050 again. Access Experiment 050-03 Participant 1 Doctor Division 4 Scientist Participant 2 O5871 Forward O5871 was instructed to wish for a tripling of his physical strength. Doctor was instructed to wish for a promotion to test the coin's capability to cognitively affect personnel. Wishes. O5871 was recorded to say, I wish someone would kill me. And predicted heads. Doctor was recorded to say, I wish for a promotion. And predicted heads. Result. Heads. It was at this time that Global Director called Site, demanding that Doctor is sent to Site for a special promotion to Division 5 clearance. When instructed about the nature of the promotion, Global Director simply responded, It felt natural, almost like he was meant to be promoted. O5871 was promptly terminated. Access Experiment 050-04 Participant 1 Agent, member of ART Quebec 9, codename Whitewater. Participant 2, Agent, member of ART Naman 6, codename Battlecry. Forward, both reconnaissance operatives were given the choice to make their own requests within the rules set in the association guidelines. Wishes, Agent, was recorded to say, I wish for a long and healthy life after I retire. Agent, predicted tales, Agent, was recorded to say, I wish that my squad would get a fucking break so we can go out for drinks. Agent, predicted heads, result tales. At this time, several on-site ADF entered the room and announced the immediate end of Agent's contract. He was then amnesticized and released shortly after. Agent, ran for Congress five years later and succeeded. He died in 20, 54 years after leaving the association. Access Incident 050-01 Participant 1 05891 Participant 2 Association Defense Force Agent Forward 05891 was instructed to wish for self-termination. ADF Agent was instructed to wish for the resurrection of Wishes Agent was recorded to say I wish would come back from the dead. Agent Predicted heads. 05891 was recorded to say, I wish I could get the hell out of here. 05891 predicted tales. Result tales. 05891 immediately vanished from sight. All attempts by the association to find 05891 have failed, and all ART platoons sent to find 05891 have failed, despite the skill level of personnel involved. After this test, the use of Class O personnel for the testing of AEP-050 has been discontinued. Notes. Where'd he come from? Where'd he go? This right here is why we need to lock these things up, away from the general public. Imagine if he'd asked to be immortal or omnipotent or some shit. I recommend formally that we research this a lot more. Without O-Class. Dr. Brain. 
value assessment. If this anomaly is further researched, it may be of extremely beneficial use to the association in the near future. This anomaly is catalogued under R1 in the meantime.